Uh, some members opposite will be celebrating the Prime Minister's first 100 days. Remarkable that this is considered an achievement these days. But during those 100 days in office, around 30,000 people, mostly women, will have been raped, of which 20,000 rapes will have been reported, and only around 320 will ever lead to a charge. The Home Secretary has responded by slashing government funding for forensics, cutting this year's funding for local police forces by £62 million, and heaping pressure onto council taxpayers to fill the gaps. Is this because of the government's disastrous mini-budget? Is it because of the government's failure to grow the economy over 13 years? Or have they simply given up on tackling violence against women and girls? Get ready for the rant. It's going to come, you know it's coming. Well, I, I must just gently point out that she's got to get with the programme, get with reality and come back down to earth. The facts are that we've increased police funding by over half a billion pounds. I've just brought in more flexibility so that PCCs around the country can increase their resources on the front line. We are on track to have the highest number ever in the history of policing when it comes to police officers on the ground. That's thanks to this government's funding and this government's policies. And when it comes to violence against women and girls, and when it comes to rape and serious sexual offences, of course, we must do better. That's why we're pioneering the rollout of Operation Soteria, which is going to improve the operational support for victims of rape and serious sexual offences on the ground and throughout an investigation. That's why we're going to have uh, specialist uh, measures in court so that victims of rape and serious sexual offences give evidence in a much more uh, appropriate manner. We're taking the steps. It's far better than carping from the sidelines. <laughs> Mr. Brenda Sharma. <laughs> what an idiot. Oh, good God. You could tell she was chomping at the bit once yet. And let's be honest, it was just it's just full of um, slogans, one carping from the sidelines. Robust, probably that was in there. And uh, just a load of slogans. 